morning guys. So I'm here coming from Hawaii and I want to bring some more clarity to some situations that have transpired. So there's been a lot of talk about targeted individuals and electromagnetic attacks, frequency attacks, and I want to bring some more clarity to that coupled with what COVID truly was and the parasitic detox that I completed. So I was fortunate enough to decode the information given by Trump over the last four years and hydroxychloroquine has been an extremely important drug along with the quote unquote horse dewormer and I want to explain what truly happens to the human body so I've completed multiple detoxes hyperbaric chambers along with NAD and mineral treatments via IV um, as I was under a situation that required me to not only vacate my home in the city and state I lived in because I was under attack by not only the local police department, FBI, and other entities, and it continues to this day. I'm tracked, I am followed, and it's interesting. Um, I just posted a video showing the Wi-Fi of a vehicle attached to one of the agencies and I have had to not run but relocate into multiple different states countries and I finally found a comfortable area where I'm not under a barrage of electromagnetic and frequency issues so if we do our due diligence on the infrastructure that has been installed, who owns the infrastructure? Why people are getting sick? Why you don't need to follow their narrative because it's not accurate. If people do the research and they spend the time taking care of themselves physically, mentally, and spiritually, you can beat anything. And I just need to keep rehashing the situation because, like I said, I've had to go to 14 different states, two countries, and I'm in the middle of the Pacific finally, and the attacks have ceased. I've lost millions of dollars. I've had my homes raided. I've had my offices raided. I have reached out for guidance and help from multiple agencies. I've come to the point where I'm not sure what to do anymore and it's a miracle that I've lasted this long and this has been about a four-year process and it's required me to really focus on myself healing the research of course into the financial markets the financial markets which brings you into Blockchain, blockchain, which brings you into AI, AI, which brings you into a whole nother realm of possibilities. And the system, whether it's private, military entities, whether it's regular military entities, whether it's the powers that be that are controlling all of the frequencies via the 5G and electromagnetic energy weapons, but I've personally experienced all of it. I've personally beat all of it, and now I'm in a spot where I'm not sure how to move forward. It's interesting. I just like doing these videos because it feels good to release the information and just release the energy and hopefully help someone else but parasite detoxes are so important especially in the united states as a majority of the food was tainted a majority of the water was tainted and i have documented evidence of the i don't even know how to use the verbiage of the stuff that will come out of your body and it's something that 
is so important to do your research on. So I've had multiple doctors, all of my medical records. I've finally secured all of my medical records and I have a complete timeline of what happened, what doctors I've seen, what they prescribed, what didn't work, what I used that did work, and everything has been a lie. They have lied to us, they have misled us, they have targeted us, they have harassed us. Like I said, I've had my home raided, my office raided, I've had millions of dollars in assets taken from my ledgers, I've had everything taken from me, and then I had to bounce from state to state, country to country, trying to find peace. And I finally found a location that is beautiful, it feels good, I no longer have the energetic attacks. The infrastructure here is an old infrastructure, it's not all that new bullshit that keeps getting installed. And there's a correlation between the radio frequency towers and the mind control slash targeting slash controlling aspects in the continental 48 states. Like I said, I've been 14 different states, probably 20, 40 cities, including Florida, New York, and none of the frequencies are healthy. It's a very interesting perspective. It's a very unique uncovering of information, but I've personally completed multiple detoxes of my entire body, including red light therapy, including different minerals via IV and NAD, which is the energy for your mitochondria and your cells. Um, I've beat multiple chronic illnesses with no medication, and people need to truly wake up. I said it before, I'll say it again, the system is not designed to help us, it has been hurting us. And the last time I said that, that's when shit hit the fan, so we'll see what happens this time. But I posted a video, I've been followed by the FBI, I've been to three different hotels here on the island, and at each hotel I see FBI, Wi-Fi's, and I see very interesting correlations of activities and it's bullshit so if you want to come and talk to me come and talk to me it's simple as that and the fact that an American born here in the United States doing his due diligence on the financial system of my country doing the research on the history of our military, the history of money, the history of how and what transpired. And that put me on a terrorist watch list. Ask yourself a question. How the fuck does that happen? That's all I got. I'll make more videos later. Thank you.